going on youtube family it's fish g it's your boy i'm back once again y'all i got a good topic for y'all today let's talk about the dark side of trying to better yourself and chasing success a lot of people always talk about the good and oh man i see you doing good for yourself i see you focused i see you doing you're living out your dreams i see you losing weight i see you glowing i see all this good stuff about you friends family and mostly strangers will tell you this but and that's cool i know you appreciate that you you who listening this is for you if this message has came to you through this youtube channel i'm glad that i can be the one to explain this to you or to confirm how you really be feeling because sometimes we need to hear from somebody else that hey this guy, this person right here knows exactly what I'm going through. Thank you. I try to talk to everybody else about it and it's like they don't understand. Well, listen, I am your brother. I am your big brother, sis. You feel what I'm saying? I am your cousin. You know what I'm saying? I am your little brother, OG. You feel me? So listen, this is just what God puts in me and I deliver it to the people. I'm nothing, you know what I'm saying? I'm nothing without you already know. So let's get that understood but the dark side of chasing success is this people will hate you i promise you it's like a signal reads off the demons know who you are i cannot make this up Y'all, you could be walking or exercising. People will turn their face up at you. You could speak to somebody walking. They'll look at you and look at your body. Why are they doing that in their head? Why he still walking? He already lost the weight. I don't understand. You know what I'm saying? And won't even speak. When people see you, your aura, your confidence about you, the way you so assure of yourself and your confidence, sometimes they will mistake that for arrogance. They want to tear you down. This is another trait of the dark side of chasing success because I know a lot of people don't talk about that. They talk about the glitz, the glamour, the fame, the people saying your name. I want you, you know what I'm saying? Or I want to see such and such or I, I want to meet him or you know what I'm saying? Or I want to meet her or yes, that's all good. Or they see you successful. They see you driving nice cars. They see your tight body. They see all that. But behind closed doors, what they don't see is that you don't have anybody to talk to. There's nobody that you can relate to except for God. Yes, that's all good. We know we have God, but as human beings, you want to be able to communicate with people. You don't have that evil spirit to where you're jealous or you hate somebody or you don't want to see somebody progress. So when you're finally getting your life together and you're progressing in life, you are waiting for that love and okay hey i'm here y'all i'm in my full-fledged potential to the universe and you're not gonna get that what you're gonna get is when you're chasing success is less friends rejection backstabbers betrayal rumors lies deceits People trying to steal from you, steal your ideas, copy your swag, copy your slang, copy anything that you come up with. People are jealous of you that have more than you because you know what? They don't have that anointing because you took the God route and you're not perfect. Let's get this understood, y'all. Stop acting like people who are godly taking this godly route like, like, like God don't get revenge. Like God ain't sending the wrath on people and flood the earth. Like he won't send you to hell and burn you up. That is not a, a necessarily nice person. But people use that. Oh, he hit me on this cheek. Then I give him the other side. Stop using that one thing to determine that all people who believe in God should let you run over them. No, it don't go like that. Matter of fact, God's people don't even play that. We wanted the strong you, you one of the strongest individuals out there that can't be messed with, cutting demons' heads straight off. You see them. And that's what happens when you're taking this journey or on this road to success. You're gonna run into a lot of difficulties, a lot of challenges, a lot of sorrow, a lot of pain, a lot of hurt. People are just not going to like you. 
And you have to accept that and keep moving. I speak to people and be like, morning. And the people will look right at, listen, fellas, this is different. This is a different level. Women will hate you. Women will become jealous of you. Men, you already know that. Men is naturally jealous. That's just a territorial thing. Every guy wants to be the most dominant guy, but it just don't happen like that. But fellas on this journey, when you're bettering yourself and you're living good and you're feeling good, women can feel that energy. And if she is full of demons or is something wrong with her, she will reject you, not because of you, because you're a better version of you. And you're more than likely better than who she really are or who she's presenting herself to be. So in order for her to feel good about herself, because when she's in your presence, her goes down. That's what this is about. It's not about riches no more. It's about energy. Who got the most energy in their spirit when they come in that room? Does it, they feel your presence. That's what it's about. You can be a me. I've been in the rooms with millionaires and they, they had no impact. No impact whatsoever. I was definitely not even close to being successful as they are, but people was coming up to me more than them. And I could see them wanting that attention, that validation. But it doesn't happen like that. I put the work in. You put the work in. And this is why I wanted to make this video because everybody is so caught up in the material side of obtaining success. But nobody talks about the dark side. Nobody talks about being lonely. People being jealous of you. Jealousy turns to hate. Hate turns to people want to kill you. This is real. So if you're watching this video right now, this message is for you. You know what you're going through. This video is for you to just confirm it that it's okay. If you're in your walk right now and you're experiencing these things, understand that it is okay. That is a part of this journey that you are doing fine and you are doing great. Appreciate y'all. Listen, like and subscribe to my content.